Hi everyone, Ravi this side. Welcome to Engineering Adda. So today in this video we are going to discuss about the n-gram search, inelastic search. Okay. So what is n-gram? We are going to discuss that and what is edge n-gram and how we can write the n-gram query in elastic search using Kivana dashboard. Everything we are going to discuss in this video. Okay. So let's get started for that. So let me try to go to the next slide and here we can discuss about the n-gram okay what is n-gram so before going to discuss about the n-gram let me try to tell you about the full search and the partial search okay so full text search is an extremely useful tool for many applications like let's say you are going to search for the product called laptop on the google so you provide the full name laptop and then you get the result for that particular name so this is called a full search one popular feature is partial word searching so let's say you have provided the uh, few character of the word laptop like lap and still you are getting the result related to the term laptop and anything which is filling the lap okay so that is called partial search to search for the partial words we can store variable length sequence of the words in a search engine another word for the variable length sequence of the word is called as n-gram okay so when you are going to search for the variable length of the uh, word then that is called as n gram now if you if we break up the word sun into n grams we will get s s u s u n u u n and then s u n again or you can say n so this is called as n gram like if you break up the word sun in the multiple uh, partial words so it can be s it can be s u it can be s u n it can be u it can be u n it can be n so all those are the n grams of the word sun okay if we store these n grams in a searching engine and associate them all to the word sun we will be able to find any document containing the word sun by searching for any of these n-grams okay so what we'll do we'll try to uh, try to divide the particular word that we are going to search in the n-grams and then we'll map those n-grams with the particular word and when we are going to search with the n-grams still we are able to find out the result for the particular word okay Elasticsearch is a great search engine we can use to perform the n-gram search. So we are going to use the Elasticsearch here. So before going to uh, write the query for the n-gram, let me try to tell you about the edge n-gram. So what is edge n-gram? It is a kind of n-gram where we can make variable length sequence of the word from the start of the word like sun. So you can see here in the edge n-gram, we can only make the n-gram from the start of the word like s s u n s u n we cannot start with the middle of the word like u n or u n so this is about the edge and gram this is what we are going to implement in this video okay so here you can see uh, the tokenizer first breaks down into the words whenever it encounters one of the list of this specified character then it emits n gram of each word where the start of the n-gram is anchored to the beginning of the words so this is telling that in edge n-gram what we'll do we'll try to create the n-grams of the particular word from the start okay example of the sun is s s u n s u n when you want to search a text edge n-gram have the advantage it can help you to auto suggest the terms related to the te search text so let's say you want to search for the uh, sun in your document okay and you have only provided s u still it is able to find out the sun if it is existing in your document and giving you the result okay and it is automatically suggesting you the words uh, which are filling the s u like let's say you have sun then it will try to uh, give you the result of the sun or something like summer some anything can be uh, any word can be auto suggested which is filling the word s u okay so this is uh, like edge and gram can help you in the auto suggest as well so now let me try to go to the next slide and these are the steps that we are going to follow here so first of all we'll try to create the edge and gram filter and edge and gram analyzer 
on the particular index okay let's say we have created one index called product and that is containing the uh, document related to the product like product has the id name price and the quantity okay so the index product is containing the document which is related to the product details okay now what we'll do first of all we'll create the agent gram filter and agent gram analyzer on the particular index do a mapping of analyzer on top of that field on which you want to create tokens or want to auto suggest so let's say you want to uh, create the token on the uh, field called product name okay or you want to uh, search the product name and once the feature of auto suggest then you have to do a mapping on that particular field okay now put some document in the index created and do auto suggest search okay so this is what we are going to do in this video so now let me try to uh, i already have uh, open my docker and here i have installed the elastic search and kibana so let me try to make our elastic search and kibana up and running i think it is running here you can see both of them are running and elastic search is up on the port number 9200 and kibana is up on the port number 5601 so now let me try to go to the browser and try to open both of them so http localhost 9200 and http let me try to open a new so elastic search is up and running now let me try to open the kibana here okay so the kibana is up on the port number 5601 okay five six zero one okay so kibana is also up you can see here you can uh, see this option you have to click here and go down and inside the management you will find this dev tool just open it and these are the some queries that i already have run and uh, let me try to dismiss this so let me try to go to the ppt and here you can see these are the steps that we are going to follow so first of all we'll try to create the edge n gram filter and is n gram analyzer so you can directly go to the elastic search and search for the elastic search edge n gram so it will tell you how to write the query for the edge n gram okay so just let me try to open it so here you can see We'll go down you can see this here we are uh, writing the query for analyzer and the tokenizer so i have created the query uh, for this so let me try to go to the kibana and uh, so here you can see what we are doing uh, we are in the setting we are uh, creating a filter which is as n gram filter and its type is as n gram and the this is the minimum gram and this is the maximum gram okay so let's say there is a word called uh, uh, word is of uh, six character so agent gram will cover all the six possibility of the n grams like one to six let i will try to tell you about uh, this uh, later on i will try to explain you in a better way what is min gram and what is max gram okay and uh, so this is about the filter and now we have created the analyzer and its name is n gram analyzer and uh, filter in the filter we are providing the n gram filter that we have created here above okay so this is about the settings now let me try to or you can say n gram filter and n gram uh, analyzer so let me try to create a index called product okay i think product is there or not let me try to see so just let me try to create the filter and the analyzer for the index called product so just here you can see we have created acknowledges to an index product is created okay 
now what is the next step we need to do first of first step we have created the agent gram filter and agent gram analyzer on the index and do a mapping of the analyzer on top of that field on which you want to create tokens or want to auto suggest so let's say we want to search based upon the name of the product okay so we'll try to create the mapping of the analyzer on the name of the particular product okay so let me try to go down and here you can see uh, let's say our index is product and we want to do a mapping we have to provide the properties and the properties we have the name on the name we want to apply the analyzer which is ngram analyzer that we have created above here you can see so let me try to do that so it is acknowledged true so this is also good now what is the next step we have to put some document in the index created so we have created the index product now let me try to put some document inside the index so how you can do uh, let me try to copy this and paste it here so let's say our index is product and we want to create one document and in the product index we want to insert couple of properties or attributes like id so let's say the id is one and product name is let's say mobile and uh, price and the quantity i just want to insert so let's say the price and price is let's say 20000 and the quantity let's say it is one okay now let me try to insert this document in the index product so you can see this is created now what i need to do let me try to create the another document let's say the id is 2 and uh, name is laptop and the price is 60000 let me try to run it and it is also created let me try to create the third document and it's tablet let's say and the id is 3 and let's say the price is 60000 for it as well so it is also created so all of the documents i have created or inserted inside the index called product now we want to do a search okay and uh, what we did we have applied the mapping of analyzer on the name you can see this so in the name it will give us the uh, ngram functionality or you can say auto suggest so now let me try to show you what all the documents we have as of now and then we'll try to do a search okay so let me try to do this i can do above here as well so let's say it is get we have to provide the index name and then underscore search and then run this query and here we go you can see uh, we have the mobile we have laptop and we have tablet these three product we have inserted in the index product now i want to search the product based upon their name and in the name we are not going to provide the full name we are going to provide the partial name and we'll see if it is suggesting us something or not okay so let me try to do that so here i have written this query which is a match all query and let me try to do a search okay so here you can see our index is product and underscore search query is match and we want to do a search on the name and in the query let's say i have provided the m o so this will auto suggest the mobile for us because uh, mobiles uh, if you will uh, what i will say if you are going to do a ngram on the mobile okay so it will try to break the mobile in the uh, terms like m m o b like m m o m o b m o b i m o b l m o b l e okay so let me try to show you those things as well uh, how the tokens are created so let's say you can see here uh, the index is product we want to do analyze and analyzes is ngram analyzer that we have created and let's say the text is mobile okay and i was telling about this uh, ngram 
min gram and the max gram you can see so the min gram is one and the max gram is six that means it will try to create the uh, n gram up to six characters okay so let me try to do this so here you can see let me try to run this and you can see the tokens are created token first token is m second is mo third is mob mobi mobil and mobile so this six tokens are created because of uh, we have given the minimum gram is one and the maximum gram is six okay so this is how the tokens are looking like and this token are restored and based upon these tokens we can uh, find out the particular product we have we can uh, provide m in the search still it will try to fetch out the mobile for us and then try to display us we can like any of the tokens we can provide in the search and we'll get the result okay so this is about that now let me try to do the search so i have in the query we have provided the mo and let me try to do the search here and let's see you can see we are able to get the mobile so similarly you can also search for like mob and let's see you still you will get the mobile so this is about the agent gram and this is how you can write the query for the agent gram okay so if you like the video please hit the like button and please subscribe the channel for more such content thanks